another video today okay that did not last long for those of you that are new to the channel I am Jasmine Garcia I am a 22 year old fitness lifestyle beauty health person and I like to share my life and my favorite things on the internet and so you are here for those of you that are returning obviously as you guys are going to see in this video this is going to be a lot more fancier footage because I did not film this myself shout out to Varissa Hey guys, shout out to you. This won't be a regular thing, probably once a month, something like that, just to kind of add a little bit of variety to the content. We're gonna go ahead and jump right into this What I Eat in a Day. It is going to be with a base of kind of quick, go-to, and healthy, and also really good for building muscle because there's a lot of protein within all of the meals that I eat. So without further ado, let's jump straight to the video and I hope you guys enjoy it. Oh, and if you want to see more videos like this on my channel, then make sure to click the like button and comment below what kind of meals you want to see in the next one. For breakfast, this has been one of my absolute favorites. All you're gonna need is to crack one egg into a cup, add three servings of egg whites, two sweet mini peppers of your choosing, and then one onion. Guys, we're not gonna use the entire onion. I'm just gonna peel it and then take like a quarter of it and chop and dice that up. From there, you're going to need about half a serving or a little more of reduced fat Mexican blend style cheese and two organic corn tortillas. I use the Mission brand, but it doesn't really matter. And then half of an avocado. So from here, all you're doing is chopping up all of your veggies. So I like to cut up my bell pepper to pretty small pieces. That way it's easier and faster to cook. And then same thing for the onion. I actually like to dice this up as small as possible because I don't want a chunk full of onion. And then for the avocado, just cutting that in half and prepping it for the very end. First, you are going to add the onions and wait for those to get translucent in color, and then you're going to add the bell pepper, and those should get brighter and then should feel softer. And then you add your eggs and add some seasoning for the scramble, and you're done. I just used black pepper, regular salt, and a dash of garlic salt. And then I just heated up my tortillas on the pan, took like 10, 15 seconds, and I added the remainder of my cheese. This part is obviously completely optional, but I love adding chili hot sauce for some extra flavor. And then from there, I just add my eggs and avocado, and I have a perfect little morning breakfast taco. After breakfast, I let it digest for a little bit, and then I head to the gym. Post workout snack, no matter what, it never fails me. After I finish a workout, I am craving carbs. So I like to use the 2% Faye Greek yogurt and I mix that with the honey that they provide. And then I add, this is my favorite granola. It is the Hemp Plus granola 
This part wasn't recorded, but I also add some coarsely ground flaxseed and I also eat it with a Power Crunch bar. I am waiting for myself to slowly get sick of this lunch, but all it is is a toasted bagel. I like to use an everything bagel and then some whipped cream cheese for less fat. Then I just use three slices of honey smoked turkey and a good handful of spinach. And that is all that is to it. From there, you just cut it in half with your butter knife and then add about a handful of some baby carrots and one or two tablespoons of hummus and your lunch is complete. And this is one of the most refreshing and delicious lunches. Everything pairs together so well. So I want to give some major shouts to Dave's Killer Bread. They just came out with these bagels and you guys know I love their bread. I've raved about them forever. But these bagels have 12 grams of protein and specifically the Epic Everything bagel has 27 grams of whole grains. What on earth? Like you can never find that in a bagel. So if you haven't picked them up yet, now's the time. Okay, I have to give full credit to Nikki B for this meal. She made it for me the other night and I have since been obsessed. It's just two handfuls of spinach, one serving of ready-made rice. You just heat it up in the microwave and you're good to go. And then I have some chicken that I cooked up the other night, so I just used the leftovers of that. And then I added half a serving of feta cheese. You can do reduced fat if you want to. And then half a serving of cranberries. But the star of this all is going to be the chunky salsa with a medium kick to it. And that's it. You stir it all up and it's kind of like a taco-inspired salad. I don't know. Amazing, though. That'll conclude this video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.